What's up guys, this is Jeremiah, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to load a custom map into a server on a Mac. So first you need a map. You can go to a website like minecraftmaps.com and go through here, like I'm going to go to survival maps. You can just go through and download any map you want, or if you already have a saved world, like on single player, you can just go to your library, application support, Minecraft, then saves, and it just shows your worlds. So you can copy that folder over to your desktop, but I'll show you that later. So I'm going to go download, let's see, I'm just going to do the Sands of Challenge. So, yeah, Sands of Challenge. And just download map. Let's see, yep. Download it. I'm going to let it load. Alright, now it's done. I'm gonna unzip it real quick. Let's see. Alright, I'm just gonna move it to my desktop real quick. Alright, so now, if you don't already have a Minecraft server, you're just gonna have to watch my tutorial on how to make a Minecraft server because you're gonna need a server to do the next step. So I'm gonna open up my Minecraft server folder and here is everything that runs the server and right here you can see world that's the world that actually loads on the server so you either get rid of that by deleting it or just move it to your desktop to save it but you pretty much you get rid of that then you move the new map that you got into the folder and you rename it world just to make sure that it'll actually load the world that you want it to load you're gonna to go to your server properties and up here at name level name you need to make sure it actually says world otherwise it won't load that folder but so yeah that should that should work out so now you're gonna start your server Here it is. And then, yeah, pretty sure this is the map. Because this definitely is not my server. So I'm going to get out of that. And if you already have a saved world, like I said, on single player, all you have to do is go back to library, application support, Minecraft, go to your saves, and you just move the world over like I said, and just simply replace the folder, just replace the world fo folder. So you would drag that in, name it world, and then it would load up that world. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope this video helped you. Make sure you favorite, like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.